Sorry, I don't agree. I believe you are the one who's about to die. In fact, there's no doubt about it. <laughs> Hey, these belong to you? Ah! Listen, ass wipe, I need some information. Tell me what I want to know and I'll save your miserable life. Otherwise, you can bleed to death. Now, tell me, where's the one they call the Fist of the North Star? My name is Ray and I'm looking for the man you've described. The man with seven wounds who calls himself the Fist of the North Star. That's quite an honor, but I'd hate for you to miss all that fun on my account. You sure about this? Silly me, what a foolish mistake. Better now? Now, take me to your boss. Ken, the man with the seven wounds, the fist of the North Star. Hmm? That may be so, but I won't know if you're telling me the truth until I find him. That's fair enough. A truce until I know for certain who's responsible for kidnapping my sister. Her wedding veil. She was about to marry her lifelong sweetheart, Ken. She was so happy. I'd been away for a while and was on my way home when it happened. Our village was attacked and almost everyone was killed. It was one of the survivors who told me that Ailey was still alive and that the man who'd taken her had seven wounds and wore an iron mask. Need a hand? Hmm. He's the one? Ailey. No! Ailey! Oh no. Ken, she can't see a thing. <sighs> you filthy animal! <laughs> It's me, your brother, Ray. You all right? No. Oh, no. Ailey. Ailey! Ken, is she going to be all right? Will she ever know who I am? That's right, Ailey. Go on, what else can you recall? Ray is me, Ailey. Don't you know me? Come on, look at me. Ailey, I don't know how to help her. She says she can't open her eyes. Julia, she has a lovely name. I believe that your separation from Julia must be linked to the ultimate fulfillment of your destiny. Fate's plan, in which we must all play a part. I have a hunch that your role's an important one. I wouldn't be surprised if the world needs you even more than you need Julia. I have no idea what fate has in store for you, but you must remain open to any possibility. Rao the Conqueror, the impressive. Don't go far, and be careful of hey! Listen, Bat, if Lynn's certain Julia's here, then we have to take her word for it. Don't worry. She won't be hurt. Rao, I'm the one you're looking for. I take full responsibility. Add to my list of crimes my friendship with the one called Fist of the North Star. And with a woman named Julia. I grew that flower for Julia. From the seeds which she gave me a long time ago. I'm not here to waste my time fighting with an underling. My fight is with Rao the Conqueror and no one else. What the Rao, hell? your man's skill with the lash leaves much to be desired. Give me someone worthy to fight. You think you can take me? Then come on. All right, Rao, now it's your turn. Lin, take care of yourself. There's a whole world depending on you. Now you. You've got to die before you can do any more damage. Then get off your horse, Rao. I'm ready. Are you? Quit stalling, Rao. Come on! Enough talk! Defend yourself, Rao! Ken! Ken, fight him and you both will die. You'll kill each other, and to what end? You're too important to the next stage of man's history to throw your life away. Please, Ken, think of the children, the innocent, yet unborn. And think of the ones you love, and who love you, and depend on your strength. They too have a role to play in the new era of man. Will they be able to survive without you to protect them? And Julia, what of Julia? She needs you so much. Please, Ken, don't fight Rao. Oh. Oh. <laughs>